Hi, I'm Darren Joss, Senior Superintendent with PCL here at the Ice District. Looking up at the exciting Stantec Tower, we're currently on level 64, pouring 65 tomorrow, and then we actually start the uh, construction atop a house. Exciting times here as uh, we soon become the tallest structure in Western Canada at 251 meters. Uh, by the way, that's five meters taller than the Bowen Calgary. We'll be going uh, over to Randy Levitt, our uh, structure superintendent. He's going to run you through what it takes to do a four day cycle. Uh, I'll tell you one thing the biggest thing that it takes is teamwork. It doesn't just take one person or one scope of work to get this done. Randy runs a tight ship up there, and everybody needs to be firing on all cylinders. Hi, I'm Randy Levitt, Structural Superintendent. Uh, here we are on level 64 of Stantec Tower. I'm here to show you what it takes to complete a floor on a four-day cycle. At day one of the cycle, we install column formwork uh, around the rebar here. A wooden box goes around here. And we close up the core by pushing these panels in. Uh, once all of that's completed, we pour the columns and core on the same day. Day two of the cycle, we jack the core and cycle the tables up to the next active floor. After the tables are set, the electrical contractors and the mechanical contractors take over. They install core line for the electrical and sleeves for the mechanical risers. To climb to the next level, we strip the formwork, climb the system. Climbing the system includes unbolting here, hydraulically climbing up to the next level, bolting back and beginning the cycle again. Uh, day three of the cycle is slab reinforcing day. Iron workers complete the top mat of each active floor. On day four of the cycle, not only do we pour the slab, we also set the column cages to get ready for the next floor to begin. As you can see, we're placing concrete. Uh, the concrete is supplied up a pipe, through the core, to the placing boom, to the placers on the slab. Each slab pour takes six hours to complete. After an eight hour cure, you're ready to start day one of the cycle all over again. One of the most amazing things being part of this project is the view. Imagine Edmonton's tallest current tower, Edmonton's second tallest tower, stacking them up, going to the top, and checking out that view. You got the River Valley, Commonwealth Stadium, Rogers Place. We've got amazing views on all corners of the building. It's just simply breathtaking. It's something to be seen.